Which earring? Mm. Strut it. What? <laughs> today in a sit down video and I'm so excited. Hi. Was like, <laughs> <laughs> Sarah's weird hand gesture. <laughs> I know I'm like looking back at all my thumbnails. I'm like, um, okay but I thought it would be super fun if I brought Jack to the channel to do like the boyfriend tag questions Freak, yeah. which I think are hysterical. <laughs> I'm super nervous. <laughs> I think he's gonna be way good at this because he is like remembered every detail about yeah. me for forever. And I, and I know, I've known her for a little bit. So. We've known each other for a really long time. So I feel like, I feel like he'll be pretty good at these, but in some of them, I don't even know if I know the answer to. Like, we haven't looked at them at all to prepare. Like we literally just decided to do this like 10 minutes ago. And I was like, oh, maybe these questions will be good. Uh, okay. So we have not talked about this at all. So we'll see. Let's see how I do. How he does. <laughs> Okay. Um, also, I have a cold sore on my lip. That's why you she's can't not see smiling. it, but that's why my face. Is <laughs> she's just gonna do a lot of. <laughs> like, oh, because I can't laugh. All the <laughs> so ignore that face. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yes. I don't know. I feel like these are gonna be hard to answer because we were so little when we started liking each other. Okay, whatever. Well, I was super little when I started liking you. <laughs> Physically. <laughs> Physically super little. Okay. Okay. Ready? When did we meet and where? Middle school, uh, probably at the middle school, unless there was like something at Westy Hill that Gigi brought we me would, to. Like, happen to have seen. And you then know. I like shook your hand in line at the end of a yeah. play or something. <laughs> but when we like started talking to each other, we met each other for sure in middle school. Yeah, for so sure. That's the correct answer. I I, I uh, was scared of Sarah's sixth grade. Um, he swears I was a bully, but I wasn't. She was. <laughs> she was if like the tallest girl. high school is watching this or middle school, comment down below and tell me if I was a bully. Because maybe I was. <laughs> don't actually don't do that and tell me if I was. But seventh grade, we started to hit it off. Yeah. That's another story. Sorry. This is, this is just going to take forever. We're going to like explain everything. Okay. Okay. Um, when slash where was our first kiss? On... In, in our, uh, uh, this is like the crowning achievement of my life. This is, this is, uh, wait, seventh grade, eighth grade, freshman year. Four years in the making that I had dreamt about for four years um, since seventh grade up through. You had a crush on me year. for a really long time before we started. And uh, so there, there's no way I would ever miss this question. In my like pool room, um, in the corner on this ancient creaky old uh love seat, love seat sofa thing I'm answering the question. um yeah <laughs> i know you knew this and uh and then brian her dad came and picked her up afterwards and i was just like still in absolute <laughs> disbelief that the biggest crush of my life kissed me on the lips so super and pumped about what that what day was it we'll never forget that that was january 1st i don't know the year uh, i can't remember the 20, year either, but... 2011 which is insane yeah. Happiest we one of the happiest before days. we started dating. Yeah, 14 days before we started dating. One of the happiest days of my life. Still oftentimes think about that. I can see it in my <laughs> brain as we're speaking. Little dweebs. Oh my gosh, Shit. but the happiest little dweeb you will ever meet in your entire <laughs> life. <laughs> okay, number three. Who yeah. said I love you first? Me on a couch that used to be right there. Right uh, there, that is the moment. Yeah. Not those couches. We've had about ten yeah. since then. There's a picture actually on our Facebook of like that night that I said it. Really? Yeah. Um, it popped up on my Aww. memories thing on Facebook the other day. But I was the one that said it. She said it back, thankfully. I did. Uh, sophomore but year. But it was like it was like six months into the relationship. I think it was seven. Seven months into the relationship. So, so we were like. We tried to be like very mature about it, even though we were still <laughs> we were very like, immature Ooh. little children. So. <laughs> We were like, we don't say that after the first one. Yeah, so we said, I like you all the time. Even though Jack's like, I've loved you since I was six. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Okay, <laughs> when is my birthday? April 24th, 1995. That's easy. 95 was a great year. It is. Yeah. <laughs> Where does my family come from? Here. I, <laughs> I mean, yeah. Right? Yeah, I don't know. Like our immediate family. Where's my dad from? Here. That might be one you may not know. If you think about it, I've visited there before. My first reaction was Georgia. That's wrong. <laughs> it was a wrong reaction. Uh, was it North? Mm-hmm. 
Michigan? Mm-mm. Oh, uh, oh, I'm Vermont, New York. New York? Yeah. Brian, I'm sorry I didn't know that about you. <laughs> yeah. It's like backwoods New York. Okay, I, I was about to say, he's not like, like a like Angelica. A Brooklyn. Okay. That's pretty cool, man. Yeah. When did you meet my parents? Um, I actually have like a really good relationship with their parents. I'm gonna move before, this up for a yeah, I before can. I started like dating Sarah. So I, Beth probably like befriended me freshman year of high school. Mm -hmm. Um, whenever I joined the speech team, the forensics team, uh, she like. So we she both competed heard, in speech and debate in high school. Yeah, the only reason why I signed up was because I was absolutely head over heels with <laughs> like, her. I was like, please, please, please. Yeah, and, and she signed me up on the very last spot on the entire list, and then I ended up doing it for the four years and loved it, and that's probably why. And beat me the last year, and I could never beat him in fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, Beth, Beth and I like formed a really cool friendship freshman year, and then I would come over to like New Year's parties, and I got along with Brian really well from there too. Uh, Maggie was around as well, so uh, freshman year of high school, met them and fell super in love with the family, and then I was obviously I super in love with her. <laughs> well, so. um, ooh, what's one thing you wish I didn't do? Oh, shit. <laughs> um, always try to turn up the temperature everywhere that we go. True. Um, Very because I am, I am, uh, I like it cold. Like in here right now, it feels incredible. And she came in with I like just her things. short sleeve, and she put that on. <laughs> there really aren't a lot of things that I don't like about Sarah. And if that's the worst thing, then that's a huge problem. I'll deal with it. Um, Plus, my dad like always has. It's always so cold. My dad like chronically keeps everything cold, so I'm used to it. But sometimes yeah. I'm like, can I turn the heat on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I just have to like sweat a, a ton while she's comfortable. So. And me and my mom like always have heated blankets because. We just have to. Yeah. It's unlivable if we don't. Yeah. So that is the that's the one thing I don't. I wish you were different in. What, what was that question? One thing wish, you like wish I didn't do. Yeah. Turn up the heat everywhere. That we I'll take have. that one. I'll take yeah. it. Uh, when was our first date? Where was our first date? Uh, La Fiesta Grande. <laughs> and in Danville, we have three Guadalajaras, which are the same Mexican restaurant. We have three of them in a little the tiny small ones. town. They're the best. I have no clue why I wanted to take her to. La Fiesta Grande, which doesn't exist anymore. Are we sure that's what it was called? Yeah, 100%. Not like Los Rodeos or something? No, it's like Los Rodeos now, I think. Now? Yeah, La Fiesta Grande. Oh. I remember it. Believe me. Believe me. Yeah, I remember so. where it was and the fact that it was Mexican food, but it's changed so many times. Yeah. I can never remember what the name yeah. of it is. Another great highlight in the life of Jack. I, for some but reason, I remember that. That's the thing is, our first date was like what like a year into our relationship yeah because we couldn't drive we were yeah really we couldn't drive children. when we started dating each other so that was like our first big like away from parents without, like we didn't have to get dropped off somewhere or like just hang out at each other's like, house yeah yeah now that was fun it was solid <laughs> okay what eye color do i have hazel well it's kind of like brownish green sometimes too i, I don't know her eyes are super cool <laughs> <laughs> and, and, <laughs> and I, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> when back in the days when, like, Jack very obviously clearly liked me. Okay, I. And I had gotten to the point where I was like, maybe I like him too. I'm not totally sure. He would like start trying to like say nice things yeah. that like, oh, okay, <laughs> you're trying to woo me. I get it. Yeah. But for some reason, like he would always just like look in my eyes, and I was like thought he'd be like, you have really pretty eyes. But he would always say like, you have really cool eyes. <laughs> yeah, smooth little Jack, smooth. <laughs> and I was like, cool. I still, cool. I eyes? still get flack because of that all of it's the true. time. All the I time. still make fun. But of still, him I wooed her, so <laughs> must have worked. It's Try true. it out on your uh, crushes, guys. <laughs> cool eyes, don't fall for it. <laughs> what? What does this even mean? What TV show do I always seem to forget? Uh, Let's just say, what's my favorite TV show? I would have to go New Girl. New Girl, which I haven't seen all the way through. I think it is really funny. Yeah, you appreciate it, but you haven't watched For it sure. all the way. But, Friends is a very close second. Oh, she got me hooked on to Friends 
like a year year ago, and it yeah. blew my mind. But New Girl was her favorite. Zoe Deschanel. Uh, whenever Sarah had uh, bangs, girl. they were twins. So yeah, we I'm were. a fan. I'm a fan. One food I don't like. Um, There's like a very oh, very obvious answer. That's like the number one food I don't like. I know. Hold on. Hold on. I was gonna say. Oh. I was gonna say. No, I was gonna say something. I was gonna say. One of your hairs. <laughs> I probably. I was gonna say mayo, but that's not really a food. She hates mayonnaise. That's true. I do hate mayonnaise a lot. Um, what food do you hate? I was thinking not like not like a mac and cheese, like mashed potatoes, but it's like a. I hate it. Barbecue. No, she I doesn't do. Like barbecue. I don't like barbecue. Uh, and there's a very obvious answer that you're I missing. know. See, I knew like, that this was going to spring traps on My least favorite thing in the world. Uh, <laughs> <Spring trap. laughs> like, what is something I hate more than anything else in the world? I'm having the biggest. I, there's so much pressure on me now. Jack, like it's the one thing I'm like. Uh, do I love it? Yes. You're gonna be so mad at yourself. It's so simple. I know. I know. Is it a meat? No, <laughs> not even close. A fruit? No. A vegetable? Yeah. <laughs> Green cauliflower? <laughs> um, Babe, you're going to be mad at yourself. I know, I know, I know. You love them in any form. Raw, cooked, sauteed. <laughs> onions! <laughs> I Shoot, she, hate can't, onions. she can't eat anything with onions in them. I Dang. hate them. I'm surprised you weren't like... I thought you were going to be like, well, onions for sure, but like, think of another food. Uh, that's on me. Yeah, she doesn't like mm. any kind of onion. Do you no. like uh, onion rings fried? Um, it depends on what kind of onion rings they are. If y'all ever been to Cheddar's, I like Cheddar's onion rings. Because they're like big and thick and crispy. I don't like the little, just like yeah, kind of Yeah, like stringy skin. ones. Yeah, mm -mm. no, no. I should have known. Oh, I did know that. But you just like to eat the crust off the outside anyway, so. So that doesn't count. <laughs> no, not particularly, no. Oh, I'm not gonna know this one. Okay. What's my shoe size? Eight. Nice! Sick! Mm. I'm like way taller than my shoe size would speak for me. Yeah, myself. she has a little tiny feet. Little yeah, tiny I'm like feet. I'm like five nine. Hey my mom's home! Oh, she can be on this too. Oh, what's she doing? Voodoo Mama cute. Beth. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> um but yeah, I should have way bigger feet than I do, but I just... They're just tiny little things. They're just tiny little small they're feet. They're always purple because she's so cold. <laughs> <laughs> so. That's so true. <laughs> they're like if truly you, blue. If you wanted to know. No right. blood flow down there. It's true. No circulation. <laughs> what am I afraid of? Everything. Um, <laughs> butterflies. Yeah. Uh, any bug. Birds. Yeah. It seems like anything in the air. Um... She, she's afraid of lots of things. Yeah. My mom's about to tell you. Thunderstorms. <laughs> she and just got Beth, so Beth is afraid of us, apparently, through the window. That was the most terrifying thing. <laughs> well, I didn't see your car. Yeah, Jack's car is out there in the front. Well, yeah. I know. I thought you all, like, he is uh, over here, y'all are gone. So I didn't see anything, and then it was just like, I uh, looked in the window, I was like, oh good, Sarah had the windows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're filming a video where I oh. ask Jack questions about me and see if he knows what they are. Oh. Am yeah. I, is it still filming? Yeah. Oh yeah. Hi, friends. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, but yeah, what am I afraid of? Everything. Basically. Everything. Is there anything I'm missing? Birds. Flying. Birds, yep. Yeah, birds, birds and flying. Well, you got better at flying. I did get better at flying. Oh, oh, flying. oh. And just the vastness of the ocean. That, or anything really, space yeah. really freaks me out too. Yeah, just how, just how big and mysterious. That's probably the biggest. Like the, the fact that she can be swimming in the ocean and something like the Megalodon can be just <laughs> swimming beneath her and she has no clue. Like if you guys have ever been on Flight of Passage, of course, we There's tie it back the, to Disney. <laughs> just gotta, because this is just my fear. Yeah. Oh. When okay. that big whale dinosaur dragon looking thing pops out of the ocean, like I literally can't look at that part because it freaks me out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Come on>. so. <laughs> um, it literally petrifies me. Yeah, I just, freaked out for some. Like I refuse to go in the ocean. Like I just won't go in it. I'm afraid of all of its creatures and the fact that I could just get sucked out there and yeah. no one could ever find me ever again. 
by the undertow. And what is it like 90% of the ocean we like haven't even I think discovered? It's 99, honestly. 99% of like living things we don't know. I don't know if it's 99. Okay. Yeah. That's really bad. <laughs> but the majority of the ocean we have never even discovered. What is so, that? I have to ask girl's opinion. Yeah. Okay. Please have the right answer. Are those feathers or leaves? Leaves. Thank God. Okay, good. <laughs> Well, I wanted to wear some floral tonight just because of the plant issue. Oh, and there was a big nasty cool. floral thing, and Maggie was like, "Buy it." It was pink and blue and yellow. I think they're. Leaves. But then I got leave earrings, so I feel like that was good enough. All right, that's perfect. Right. Mom's Thank directing you. Little Shop of Horrors, and I think tonight. Big time, we're going. Okay. Okay. What's my favorite sandwich? Uh. Well, you could probably speak to Melton. So yeah. I always get there. That's you pretty get much the TBS. Today. It's the turkey, bacon. Sandwich? <laughs> Swiss. Swiss cheese. And it's on a croissant. Um, she so loves good. her a good uh, grilled cheese. Mm -hmm. uh, I think those are... I don't really eat a lot of sandwiches. Peanut butter oh, jelly. spicy Italian. Oh, yeah. Always Italian's go. everywhere you go. If yeah. we're like on a... If you go to Subway... Not or only does she sandwich. date a spicy Italian... Wow. A spicy <laughs> Italian. A spicy Italian. But she... Uh, she orders it everywhere she goes. <laughs> This reminds me of you. Spicy <laughs> <laughs> right, attack. Um, what would I eat every day if I could? Pickles. Which, yeah. Pickles. Everywhere sure. you go, pickles. Pickles. Dill pickles, <laughs> those big pickles, the jars of huge not pickles sweet pickles. My forearm. I do not do bread and butter pickles. I would rather poke my eyeballs out of my head than eat those. They're all kind of gross, so. No. You kind of start to like them. Don't a eat them. A little bit, a little bit. But I still give them to her whenever I have them. And then That's she true. proceeds to have pickle breath for the rest of forever. And Makes up for his onion breath whenever he <laughs> <laughs> Okay, what is my favorite cereal? Oh, peanut butter Captain Crunch. Now, she's not as opinionated when it comes to cereal as I am. Jack's but I do a know cereal that. nut. Yeah. He eats so much cereal. Cereal is the best thing on the face of the planet. Okay, this, I don't I don't even have an answer for. So I'll skew it. It says, what is my favorite song? I don't know. Only favorite song. But my favorite band? The Ovalos, for sure. Yeah. I was going to say favorite song, probably, old Ella and Louie. That's true. Dream a little dream of me. But song, I don't know. I don't know if you can pick a favorite song <laughs> because there are so many different genres and different yeah. moods that you're in. Um, yeah. But the Jack mood that she gets in, definitely. Dream a little dream of me. That's the best one. Or uh, Burn by Usher. Mm. I see the future. When you say <laughs> nobody. And then she, she freaking harmonizes it, and I feel super cool when we see it in the car. <laughs> the it's a win win. Harmonizes really. to Usher. <laughs> she harmonizes to everything, and every time my heart flutters. <laughs> And that was the most embarrassing thing I have said ever. So <laughs> my sports team, Cubbies. Go Cubs! Why Big is that Cubs my favorite fan. sports team? Yeah, probably because of the spicy Italian that she's getting. <laughs> um, oh, the spicy! But who's your favorite player on there? Come on. I mean, Chris Bryant. For sure. For Chris, sure. if you're watching this, I love this you. This is here now. It is a family party. Old Maggie. Old Maggie. Oh, Maggie McGee. Maggie McGee. <laughs> she loves some Starbucks. Oh, oh she's looking good. Let me know y'all are here. <laughs> Sorry, you can't come in. Creep on them. This is a this is a good question. <laughs> You'll be answered. This is my sister. Oh, I was pretending to pick my nose in the background. <laughs> you can't see your nose. Oh, good. It's only like your oh. shoulders down. Oh, good. That okay. is really my best part. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. What is my favorite cake? Uh, she doesn't really like cake. Ding! 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 <laughs> I thought that was like favorite cake. 
Uh, I don't know if there's a twist that. on this. That was the twist. That's the twist. I don't that's like it. cake. We liked, uh, we liked that one cake at the uh, Yachtsman Club. The three layer yeah. banana. But we're just both not cake people. We're not cake people. You give me I a cookie, brownie, cheesecake. Slice of car. Cheesecake might work. Eh. I didn't say that cake. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Okay. But yeah, not big cake people. No. no. Sometimes I like, like I, I'll eat cupcakes because they're like really tiny amounts of cake. Yeah, we like sprinkles. <laughs> we did like sprinkles. sprinkles I'll be here saying we like sprinkles. Oh, I like, hate sprinkles. I don't like, like sprinkles. Sprinkles sucks. <laughs> Suck. But the place itself. Yes. yes. Do I play sports? If so, what? No. Unless sleeping's a sport. True. She's great at that. Competitive sleeping. <laughs> yeah, not my strongest. She used to play soccer in middle school. That's true. And did I crush it? No. <laughs> you were pretty good. No, I wasn't. You were better you're than I was at soccer. No, I was. Was I? You were, a star you were a starter from the very beginning. I mean, you weren't like top on the team, but you started. Even they recruited like me because I run really fast. Like, that's just, I've always hey, been able to... What up in a contender? Okay. And I don't know what for, but I maybe could have been a contender in something. legs are, are longer than... I just have really long legs, so I just had, like, a way bigger stride than everybody yeah. else. I played soccer in middle school for three years. For the three years that I played, I was a forward, mind you. So that's people that score all the goals. The three years I played, I scored two goals. Nice. One of them was with my eyes closed. Like, afraid of the ball, like... I was like in like the goal area and somebody had like shot it. The goalie blocked it and I was like, ah, cause it was coming back at me and it bounced off my shin guard and went in the goal. Did you play awful? Oh yeah. It was the first time I had ever scored. And so I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I meant to do it. And you know how like everyone like runs and celebrates and like, yeah. and I was like, this is so cool. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't actually. Yeah, her, her athletic I didn't even know what happened cause my eyes were closed. Very long. No. I got really, theater was my thing. So once I got past middle school and I could actually like do theater for like an extracurricular thing in high school, That's I was what like, you did. who needs sports? Yeah. I would spend hours on what? Uh, I'd say anything with art or, or yeah. with theater yeah. or forensics. So like memorizing scripts. Um, yeah. She had this big project senior year of high school where she was decorating like it sounds weird But she was like decorating a door that yeah. the art uh, The art classroom's door and she made this big elaborate design on there If the, the things that Sarah got super immersed in had to do with art or theater and I think that's still probably It's probably still pretty really relevant. Accurate. Yeah. Yeah, you're true. Making vlogs maybe now. Yeah Hours <laughs> Waiting for things. it to upload what, uh -huh. what talents of mine do you love? Oh, jeez. Where to, where to begin? Um, I, think I, I think I enjoy all the... I like this question. I, I enjoy all the art and theater things. Yeah. I, I super enjoyed um, seeing her act and seeing her on stage and um, in speech tournaments and stuff because she's so good. I enjoy that. I enjoy um, going to like her, her senior exhibition and seeing her, her artwork there. Um, I mean, there are a million things I love about you. You've always been super supportive of, you know. Um, talent, so that's probably summed up there. Ooh, do I have any nicknames? What is it? SB, yes, Bizzle, um, oh. <laughs> Stretch. Uh, True, that's my dad. Uh, is there anything else? Breezy. Um, breezy. A beautiful cover girl. Um, <laughs> is there anything else I SBM. call you? SBM. You don't call me that, but <clears throat> uh, college people call Sizzling me. Sizzling Sarah. Nope. <laughs> That's a new one though. <laughs> Slightly. Um, if you're Kyle Berry. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. I think you, that's the extent. You like kind of strictly. Okay, this is kind of a weird thing about my name. So my name is Sarah Beth. But my actual name, like my God-given birth name, is Sarah Elizabeth. So it's like two separate names, and then we just kind of made up our own and go by Sarah Beth. So like that's always what I've gone by. That's like what I write on papers, documents, whatever. I write Sarah Beth. But people get really confused because they're like, what's your middle name? And I'm like, Elizabeth. I'm like, Sarah Beth Elizabeth? <laughs> I'm like, it's a little redundant. No, I'm Sarah Elizabeth. 
So, sorry if I just blew your mind. Some people get like really offended. Whoa. They feel like I've lied and to them. And it's Sarah without an H, guys. Yeah, no without H. An H. They should know that by now. If they don't. Yeesh. Yeesh. <laughs> um, I had to test your foot yeah, with my toe. No, your hand with my toe. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so it's Sarah Elizabeth. But he, forever, he's like the only one, really, that calls me Sarah. Like, just Sarah. It's I don't know why. It's kind of been a thing. I don't yeah, know why. Yeah, he's like just, like, I don't know. If you call me Sarah Beth, it feels really weird. Oh, it's I, like, I very rarely call you Sarah Beth. It's, it's weird, but Sarah he's like the recipe. only person. So, but he, pretty strictly, when he's talking about me, like with his friends and stuff, he calls me SB. To me, he'll call me SB. Mm -hmm. That, like, feels like my name coming from him. Yeah. But then, like, in college, everyone called me SBM. They added, like, the M on yeah. the end. I don't know. It's weird. Interesting. Unique. My name is kind of a nickname in itself. Mm. Um, what is the first thing I do in the morning? Uh, I would think just lay there and take a very long time to get out of bed. That is completely yeah. accurate. So checking our phone, trying to go back to sleep. Yeah, if possible. Stretching. Uh, that's probably it. Yeah, I don't get out of bed. If I wake up on my own, like, if I don't have anywhere to go, like, I'm in bed for, like, a solid, like, two hours just doing nothing. Yeah. She's really good at that, again. Really competitively. good. Competitively. Huge talent. Yeah. <laughs> that you love about her. Come, this is the last one. Okay. <clears throat> Complete this sentence. My girlfriend is... <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm waiting. She is one word, or can I just like go on for a couple minutes? You do you. <laughs> Those are your answers to the question. Is a stud. Um, she <laughs> is super creative, super super nice. Um, I think no matter who she comes in contact with, even the people that are kind of hard to love, she's always super kind and super patient. Um, She's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um, she uh, she's funny. Oh shoot, funny is probably the n number one thing. Actually, nobody on the face of the planet has made me laugh more over the last what ten or eleven years. Yeah, that um, goes the same way for both of us. Though we just yeah. crack each other. Yeah. The other one's really funny. I don't know. She's the best. I'm a I'm a lucky dude, but. Uh, I don't know. I could, I could go on for a real long time. But she's just super nice. I think everybody on here would agree is just like you're super supportive, super encouraging and open and friendly to the bomb. She is a stud. A stud. So the OG answer stands true. Yeah. I am yeah. a stud. <laughs> Everything else speaks to your studliness. <laughs> Ooh, my studliness. I like yeah. it. Um, that's it. That's all the questions that we had. I think I did pretty well. There was only yeah. that onion uh, dilemma was the only one that I kind of ran into. Which I thought was going to be like the dead set obvious answer. Yeah. I think I just had a brain poot. <laughs> <laughs> a brain toot? A brain poot. Um, yeah, this is fun. This was fun. <laughs> so, I like having Jack in videos and you guys just think he's hysterical. Like literally we did a live stream the other day and everyone was just like cracking up. That was super fun. Cause you're just freaking funny. <laughs> and he has like random facts about everything and it's just a good time. Yeah. So if you guys want to see more of Jack in the videos, <laughs> let me know. Or just subscribe to my channel, um, <laughs> mostly Jack, uh, where I'm talking about all things Disney, <laughs> all things life in Kentucky. Uh, Psychology, lying to you. books. Um, yeah, I don't have a channel. That's, that's false. But sometimes he occasionally likes to come on my Instagram story and let everyone know that he does and is mocking me. Bye. <laughs> He's like, blink. <"Link's> <laughs> He's like, you're the worst. Oh, it's just so funny to see her on there. I, I think it's cool because Sarah doesn't change when she gets like in front of a camera. She's always pretty genuine and authentic. Um, but the, the greetings and the goodbyes are for sure 100% my favorite thing to make fun of. Um, yeah, I, she, I, I don't know how you remain yourself so well in front of a camera because I, I feel like a lot of people feel the pressure to, to change. But no, she's very good at being herself and sleeping. <laughs> That's true. And being scared of things. Get my awake self. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's, that's all. <laughs> Yay. Yeah, we might do another one of these little game things. Sometimes. Yeah, I thought about like how I did with the roommates where we did like who's most likely to whatever. Um, I thought about doing that one, but we went with this one today. So if you guys want to see that video, let us know and we'll make it because we really like filming yeah, stuff together. It's super fun. She. Uh, also, sorry, my this couch is a mess. I don't know if my mom's gonna kill me if I don't say something. This is all my stuff, which is a jacket and a blanket, so, sorry. Yeah, Beth, it looks great other than Sarah's mess, for sure. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> but that's it from us. Bye. <laughs> Go check out our other videos. There will be a box right here. <laughs> there will not be a box. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. <laughs> Well, we'll see whenever you put the music on there. How well it was. Wow. Okay. If it's too flat, just edit it out. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna leave it. I'll leave it in. All right, that's it. Bye. <laughs> Wakanda forever. What was that? Wakanda, Wakanda forever. So I haven't seen it. It's all Infinity Wars. Wrecked. No spoilers, but wrecked. I don't care for superheroes. He doesn't really like superhero stuff. He's too cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but this is probably not going yes. on the video. Oh, it's going. <laughs> See ya later. <laughs> also, this is what I've been staring at for the majority of this time. <laughs> this, Horrifying. This is like my dad and my cousins and all them. They have like a fancy football league and my dad won this year and this is like the trophy of the year. <laughs> so that has been staring at us right behind the camera this whole time. <laughs> I don't even notice it anymore because it's just... This video is never going to end. I'm sorry. <laughs> no. That's on me. You're truly really sorry. Uh, okay. Uh, just not flexible. That's true. Maybe we should do these questions and like flip it when I answer them about you. Another time or right now? Yeah, another time. This video is already going to She would hour. suck at that because we always I'm do truths and a lie. Good. Wow, two truths and a lie. I think it just comes from me savoring every little tiny moment with my seventh grade crush. <laughs> so I remember everything. Um, and then I'm just a little dweeb that she barely remembers anything about. No. Just kidding. She's better than that. She's better. But my memories do come in like full force like freshman year compared to like sixth grade. Yeah. I remember like every little conversation. Okay, not that far, but. Yeah. Writing my name in the corner of your paper. <laughs> we will not share that. On here. I love that. Uh, one day, we'll share all the little things that I did because yeah. I'm superstitious and wanted to date you so bad. I just like her a lot. <laughs> Yeah, that's <laughs> 5,000 okay. people know that already. That's true. Bye! <laughs> this, this is how he used to smile when he was little. Okay, we're truly leaving. <laughs> Peace. Bye! <laughs> it's recording. <laughs> Don't put this on there. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to record like way before because I thought it would be able <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> <laughs>